Welcome to Present Trades tutorial on creating a 3D model and generating a 2D draft automatically using BricsCAD. In this video, we'll guide you step by step as we model a pipe and its flanges using BricsCAD's powerful tools. First, make sure to switch to the 3D modeling workspace, which sets up everything you need for this session. Now, let's create the lower flange. Head over to the Home tab and click on the Box tool. For this design, we'll set the dimensions to 500 units for both width and length. Use the Tab key to quickly switch fields and set the height to 30 units. But wait, we don't want the corners to be sharp. So we'll use the DM Fillet command, which makes the hidden edges visible. Just select all the edges and you'll see how the corners become nicely rounded. Next, we need to add holes to the flange. Let's create a cylinder at one of the corners. Hover over the upper edge, select the desired center, enter the radius and drag the cylinder up or down to set the height. We'll set it to more than 30 units to ensure it passes through the flange. Now, to save time, let's use the 3D Array command to duplicate the cylinder across the flange. After selecting the cylinder, choose the Rectangular Array option and set two rows, two columns, representing the number of holes, and set both distances to 400 units. If the array appears outside the flange, simply use negative values, minus 400, to reposition it. Use the subtract command to subtract these cylinders from the flange, creating the holes we need. Let's move to the center of the flange to add a circle for the pipe space. Right click to select the geometric center, set the radius to 140 units, and use the DM push pull command to drag the circle down, hollowing out the flange's center. With the lower flange complete, we're ready to create the pipe. First, Draw a line from the center to define the path. Adjust its angle and height as needed. Then use the fillet command to smooth the connection between two lines, joining them together to form the sweep path. Create another circle to represent the pipe's outer surface. And from the model tab of the quad cursor, select the sweep command. Choose the created line as the path, and there you have it the pipe is formed. Now, let's duplicate the flange. Select it using a crossing window, activate the manipulator tool, and hold the control key to create a copy and position it at the pipe's other end. To align the flange precisely with the pipe, head over to the parametric tab and select the concentric 3D constraint. Align the central hole of the flange with the pipe, ensuring the second selected object adjusts to match the first. Use the Coincident button to merge the two components together. Now let's combine the pipe into a single unit using the Union command. This step is essential for rounding the outer edges and creating beveled edges on the inside. If you skip this step, the rounding and beveling won't work. We're almost done. Apply the DM Fillet command to round the outer edges and use the DM Chamfer command to create beveled edges on the inside. Now that the 3D model is complete, let's quickly generate a 2D draft. Use the View Base command and select Entire Model. Move your cursor to switch views and click to generate the 2D draft automatically. As you can see, by just moving your mouse to change the direction and clicking, BricsCAD will automatically create the 2D view from that angle. To create section views, use the View Section command, then choose the section you want to view. And for detailed views, use the View Detail command. Simply select the points you want and watch BricsCAD generate detailed sections for you. Finally, we can add annotations to the 2D draft. Head to the Annotate tab, select your desired annotation type, such as Radius, and click on the relevant part to display the measurement. And that's how you go from a complete 3D model to a precise 2D draft, all in BricsCAD. BricsCAD makes the transition from design to documentation smooth and straightforward. Ready to explore these features? 
Start your free trial of BricsCAD today and bring your 3D models to life. Happy designing!